Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. We'll continue on with our Mass Effect Andromeda series. Feel free to leave a like, subscribe, and comment on the channel. Let's continue. Pathfinder, this is Nexus Control. I've decrypted the scrambler you found. Sending you the information now. Good when job. Pathfinder out. Pathfinder. Sam? Received, Pathfinder. The scrambler contains all the evidence necessary to incriminate Spender. Drac will want to see this. I'm worried about this place. Vorn wanted me to give you this. A plant? A flower. He says it couldn't grow in Tachanka, but it has a new life here. I think he was trying to be romantic. <sighs> Sentimental fool. Spending his time growing flowers. It's a waste of time. Has no benefit to Krogan's survival. He was trying to be sweet. Cut him some slack. You're as bad as he is. Did he say how to take care of it? Just give it love. Nothing more for now. Try not to die out there. Maintenance crew, please report to the commons area. We've got everything we need on Spender. I've been waiting for this moment for nearly a year. Ready? Let's go confront Spender. Be nice to bring his head back to Morda on a pike. You know, as a gift. He's Nexus personnel. Addison and Kandros will decide what to do with him. Spoil sport. I didn't have a choice. Arone said they'd kill me. You helped the mutineers, Spender. That was a choice right there. All you had to do was ask for help. Instead, you put everyone else at risk to save yourself. People died because of you, Spender. They said no one would get hurt. I didn't hurt anyone. It's not my fault. You're done now, buddy, and with any luck, they'll give you to me. Everything the Pathfinder's saying is true. Here's the proof. A scrambler packed with logs and credit transfers to exiles. This has been going on since the mutiny. He's been altering files, stealing supplies, communicating with them. We have a confession from Arone, one of the exiles. Arone. On the record this time. We've been working with Spender since the mutiny. He armed us, and now he keeps us supplied. As long as we keep heat on the Krogan. I don't know why he hates them, but he really hates them. I can't even begin to fathom the damage he's responsible for. Like your hands are clean, Kandros? We all wanted the Krogan gone. I just made it easier. The Exiles think I work for them, just like you think I work for you. That's what real politics looks like. Right under our noses. God damn it, Spender! The Krogan are gone. Spender forced their hand. And you let him do it. I... Damn it. Damn it! Tan was on my ass about the Krogan so much, I let myself be blind to Spender. You're getting a chance to fix this now. Let's start with taking our side when my clan tries to negotiate a better deal with Tan. You need us, and frankly, we need you. You're right. I'll back you up. We'll do it right this time. So, what about him? Lock him up. He won't be the last, but he'll make a fine example. You're just gonna throw me in a cell? Could be worse. We could throw you off the station. Think about that for a moment. Thanks, Ryder. You have no idea how glad I am this business is settled. Hello again, Pathfinder. Has there been any immediate reaction to exposing Spender? Of course. The damage he did. That'll scar us for a long time. There's also the crow I've had to eat. Can't say it wasn't deserved. We're all better off without him. Brecker might disagree. His job now includes everything Spender did. Thanks ever so much. How are we doing on the viability front? Aiming for success. 
It sounds pat, but you're living up to the job. How has the Nexus reacted to the foothold I've established? People are eager to help. The shortages are obvious, but you're turning it to inspiration. Havaral is a draw for the research-minded, despite there being so little established. It remains unusual despite the corrected vault. It may yet be a surprising producer. We shall see. There's so much beneath Vold. Some are calling it beautiful, but not when I'm around. Poetry remains off-limits. While Tate is a master at bringing out resources, there are legitimate concerns about the connections you use to place it. Reyes is open to reconciliation. Of a sort. Tan is livid, of course. Giving the Exiles any concession legitimizes them. Keep an eye on it. There's only so much I can deflect, and only so long as you can promise stability. A surprising number are moving between here and Elodin. It's very familiar, bringing the Krogan back. You don't mind that Morda gets concessions? Not if the Krogan are under our banner. Tan takes it personal. I go by the numbers. I'll eat some crow if it gets us resources. Director Addison? Pathfinder. Do I even want to know? Hey? Oh, this? Some idiot who got talked into a headbutting contest with me by his buddies. Some buddies? Hey! You! Not in my bar. I know you. Nexus. Your people hurt my friends. Now, we're gonna hurt you. Looks like someone wants a fight. You up for it, Ryder? You know I am. You start this, I'm gonna finish it. Yeah? You on what army? <laughs> I don't need an army. I've got a Krogan. Just what do you think you're doing? It's not getting too old for this shit. Ah, hey, Ryder. Do me a favor. Don't tell Kesh about this. No way I'm getting on Kesh's bad side. I'll rat you out the first chance I get, old man. Oh, figures. And probably wise. She's a tough one, my Rushan. That fight was a riot, huh? I'm surprised they let us back in here. Are you kidding? We're legends now. Umi should let us drink for free. So Reyes was the charlatan. He fooled everyone. Hard to trust a guy like that, but then I don't have to. Don't have too much fun. It's early. Alright everyone, this concludes this particular episode. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll catch you all in the next one. Later.